While it may still be the first days of fall, we're already looking at the winter forecast for the inland northwest and whether it's going to be El Nino or La Nina, and it's likely going to be La Nina for the second straight winter. Before we get to how that affects our area, La Nina itself has to do with temperatures in the ocean waters around the equator in the Pacific, this exact area that I have highlighted here. It's forecasted to be just a few degrees, maybe about one degree Fahrenheit below normal, but that's just enough to be considered a La Nina winter, which influences the jet stream placement and weather pattern during the winter months. That usually gives the Pacific Northwest a colder, wetter, and sometimes snowier than average winter, but it usually just favors it. It's not always a guarantee. So I looked at the past 10 La Nina winters, last year being one of them. We were slightly above average in terms of snow, but it actually wasn't all that much colder, not last year. And of course, our two of our three snowiest seasons all time back in 2007, 2008, 2008, 2009 were also La Nina winters. So it certainly could be colder, could be snowier, could be wetter, starting to favor that for this upcoming winter. But of course, only time will tell. But at least that gives us a first look of what to expect for the season ahead.